All right, we're going to be doing some cooking today, and we're also going to be talking about a great event as well. That's the perfect combination of things. Joining us this morning is Chef Casey Ward, who is going to prepare a salad. Yep. Chef, you are the owner of a couple restaurants. Tell us the restaurants that you own. Sure thing. It's Flora in West Hartford. Okay. Uh, we're mostly vegan there. Oh, that's and fantastic. Then, yeah, and then uh, I also have Rooster Company over in Newington. And so we paired up with um, Connecticut Humane Society mm -hmm. uh, early on over at Rooster Company. My daughter, who's Love you, Bella. Yeah. Just turned in uh, 13 on June 2nd okay. on the the day of the event. Oh, great. She was the one who really set this whole thing in motion um, where she said, I want to put fun back in fundraising. That's and awesome. That just Made me melt. So, <laughs> that, like, so that means that that you're going to be doing a lot of cooking for this event. I yes. Think, right. Yep. Um, for sure. So is this dish one of the one of the dishes that's going to be at the event? I should it ask is. you that. Okay, yes. Fantastic. So panzanella tell us what we're salad. Make. So a panzanella salad is a bread salad basically. Okay. And what you want to do most importantly with the bread? Mm -hmm. is I'm smirking because that's my kind of salad. I'm yeah. just like bread salad <laughs> sold, sounds good to right? me. All right. It's like a sponge though. You got to make it dry so that it can absorb all the flavors okay. of the sherry, of the olive oil, mm -hmm. of the red onion, the cucumber, the tomatoes even, and so as it sits, it absorbs all those wonderful flavors, marries all together. Um, I like to garnish it with a little bit of nice green olive. Great. Yeah, so then, tell us some of the ingredients that go into making this, this type of salad for people who want to do it. Right, right, today. right. So red onion, just shave it nice and thin. Mm -hmm. uh, cucumber, shave that nice and thin. And then the tomatoes, I just have some uh, little baby heirloom tomatoes. We'll pop those in with the, the cornbread. Okay. Um, but this is also nice because if, if you have leftover bread, this happens to be cornbread because we're doing the barbecue event. Sure. You know, riffing on the, the barbecue. Uh -huh. um, so I'm, I'm trying to, you know, embrace and harness all of the, all of the accoutrement sure. that you would expect from, um, you know, barbecue. So we're going to have uh, um, chicken rodeo sliders, this cool. like uh, cola barbecue, little uh, chicken slider. Uh -huh. uh, we're going to have representing uh, Floor, the, the vegan based restaurant that I have, a, uh, a, a vegan bean chili. Oh, wow. And I'm going to be demonstrating that there. So please. Awesome. You know, everybody come out, see how I do it there on site, sample all the food. It's at um, AS Labinic over in Berlin. Okay. Um, tickets are on sale $45 for an adult, $10 for a child. Uh, all the proceeds, and I think this is rare, where you're able to give your money and it all goes to the right place. You know what I mean? Uh -huh. um, all of those proceeds are going to go to the Connecticut Humane Society that pays for all of the, the medical needs of these. Uh, of these animals, yeah, um, and who doesn't love animals? I no, mean, of course. I think it's scientific proof that it takes years off your life when you have a pet. You know, that's right. You only look 13 years old yourself, actually. I appreciate that. I just shaved. <laughs> yeah, that's great. So finishing, so finishing up this salad. It, how how do we finish this off? You said that we add things like uh, vinegar to it, sherry right, vinegar, right. and olive oil, and you, things like that. With salads, you always want to go like a three to one on oil to vinegar mm -hmm. ratio, whether it's lemon juice, whether it's uh, whatever for the vinegar. So just a little splash of the vinegar mm -hmm. and then a little more of the olive oil. Yeah, it gets a good amount of olive oil over there. Oh, Toss it up. Hey, there you hey, go. Hey, now it's a party. <laughs> That's right. So when, when you mix this whole thing together, is this yes. one of those things that people want to serve right away or you want to let it sit and kind of marry for a little bit of time before a, you serve it? A little it? bit. You know, this is great for this weekend when you have guests coming over, you have the barbecue going on at mm -hmm. home. This is going to get better after it sits for five minutes, ten minutes, twenty minutes, even a half an hour. It's going to be even it's more fantastic. flavorful because it absorbs all those flavors. It doesn't look extremely complicated to make either. Uh, tell everybody again one more time how they can find uh, or when the event is. Give yes. us a little bit more information about that. So one more time. June second, okay, over at AS Labinic. Go to. Uh, Connecticut Humane Society to buy tickets in advance. Mm -hmm. You can show up and purchase tickets there. Forty-five for an adult, ten dollars for a child. Um, you can uh, check out more info on my website, Flora, uh, Weha, uh, so F L O R A W E H A mm -hmm. dot net. I'll have information on there. Um, but yeah, please, you know. Come Tell on your out. friend, come out, check yes, it out. Absolutely, and, and enjoy some really great food as well. Thank you so much for coming yes. in today. Really Thank appreciate you. that.